So today I have an amazing art tutorial for you guys and it involves rainbow, of course. And it's a hairstyle. It's my favorite hairstyle. Ta-da! It's a rainbow bun hairstyle. Isn't it so cute? I can't yeah. wait. I know, it's so cute. Even Owen likes it. That's how awesome it is. So all you need for this is paper, a pencil, an eraser, a sharpener, maybe, and some pens. Don't worry if you don't have these pens. You can just use gel pens. Yeah. Okay, so first we're gonna make just like a little dot of where we want our bun to be. So I'm gonna put it like right, probably about right there. It's like a little dot. And then I'm gonna make little guidelines for the start of the bun, so like one on top. And then for the bottom line, it's gonna be like more. So like a little finger space maybe. And then you're gonna connect those lines with like a little, kind of like an oval, you can call it. And this will be the bun. And you want to make sure that the little dot you drew is very close to the top because that's how real buns look. And you want it to look very realistic. And make sure that you draw lightly also in case you erase any mistakes. Okay, now we're going to make lines going out from the dot that we made. Curve lines out to like the side of the bun. So it look, kind of looks like a little beach ball in a way. And those will be like the strands of hair, that's what they are. You should make a big one in the middle. And then there's like two ones on the sides. That's usually where I like to make my head shape. Okay, now for the head shape. Draw two lines, pretty much like right there. Okay, and the head shape is gonna be very round. And remember, this is gonna be the back of the head, so there isn't like any details of like the chin or anything. And since this is gonna be a high bun, you wanna make sure that you don't start your head like up here or anything. Okay, once you're done with the head shape and you like how it looks, now we're gonna do the same thing we did up here with the strands of hair, but on here. And there's gonna be about like five maybe of these, maybe six, cause it's gonna be the colors of the rainbow. And they're like coming out from underneath the bun. Cause these strands of hair connect to these ones. And make sure these ones are like kinda curved too. Cause if they're straight, it will not look right. Okay, now we're gonna do the neck and then the shoulders. So how I usually find the neck, I try to line it up with the bun a little bit. So like, right here and then right here maybe. That would probably be a good size. And so take it and then make it curved. And this is the part where I like to check to make sure my neck is like, or the shoulders are even. So right now, see how they're not even? That's why I always like to use like a paper or a ruler to check to make sure they are even. And the shoulders are pretty easy. There's just like a curved line. So like straight, curve, straight, curve. That's kind of how I think of it. And then there will be the rest of the body, but I'm not gonna do that today. Okay, once your shoulders are even and you think you like how everything looks, then we're gonna start to do the tracing with black for the shoulders and not the hair. So just the shoulders. And before we even do that, we're gonna lighten up all of our lines. So like, I just like to use a big eraser and like, kind of like do this. So everything is a little bit lighter for the hair especially. So when you color it in later, you don't see a lot of dark pencil lines. There we go. I can always go back there later and erase a little more. I'm just gonna do the shoulders for this. And if you don't have this pen, don't worry. You can just use like a thin black Sharpie. Okay, I'm gonna erase some of these pencil lines left over from the black. So now we're gonna start for the hair. I finished testing out all my colors and now I'm ready to color. I'm gonna start with red on this side. So I'm doing like two shades of red, these ones. Make it like little bands of hair, like coming out from the bun, coming out from the bottom of the hair. And make sure in the middle, like right here on every color, there's white kind of, a lighter color. That's why I have two colors. So just the very top and the very bottom. See how there's like light there? That's gonna be light reflection on the hair. It probably doesn't make much sense now, but once you watch me do the other strands, you'll probably get it better. Now I'm gonna move on to orange. I have two shades of orange. I'm gonna do the light one first. Kinda like this. And then you'll do it going to the top two. And I'll do the darker shade of orange. Do the same thing I did for the red, a little bit on the bottom and some on the top. And the closer we get to the middle of the hair, 
the more white in the middle that there should be because it's like a light reflection. Okay, now onto the yellows. And I'm gonna take this darker color. A few in between. Because the more blending, the more realistic it looks. Okay, now we're gonna do green. I have two colors of green. Start with light. And so this is like a neck part, you're gonna do like little tiny little fans, because that's like the end of the hair, I guess you could say. And then you're gonna go like towards the middle, and then to the other side. See how I'm like switching off right there? And now we're gonna do the dark green. Now we're gonna use, I'm gonna use the light green and like blend it a little bit since this is like a really dark green. Okay, now we're gonna do the blues, starting with light as always. And now onto the purple for the last color of the strand of hair. And after the strand of hair, we're gonna go into the bun. And if you're starting to notice, this is like what I was talking about, like kind of like curves up, I guess, the strand of like light, like a light reflecting on your hair. That's what it is. I'm just gonna fix up a couple little spots real fast. Okay, let's go to the bun now. Okay, so you see how there's like strands of hair that kind of connect here? So this is obviously gonna be green, this is probably gonna be blue, and this is gonna be purple. And if it's really green, it'll be yellow, orange, and then red. So I'm gonna start with the green, because we're right here. The same kind of thing as we did before. And up here, towards like the little dot we drew earlier, that part is gonna be very dark up there for all the colors. Okay, I'm gonna do blue next. So see this strand is kinda like connected to here. Okay, on the purple. And up towards like the higher we get of the bun, there's not gonna be as much of like a light. Okay, so I have a couple different color combinations that I didn't use down here, like these darker pinks and these pinks, so I might like use them next, but first I gotta finish like orange, or yellow, orange, and red, and see how far they go. And then I'll decide like if I'm gonna use the pinks or not. So next will be up here on the bun will be yellow. So we'll do that next. Okay, now we're gonna do red, reddish pink, these two colors are red. And then the last little strand up there is gonna be probably these two colors of like pink. So that's pretty much it for the hair. So I'm just gonna do a couple little touch-ups and then that'll pretty much be all. So basically what I'm touching up is like up here, since it's like the middle of the bun where all the hair strands like go in. I'm just making that like all darker in the very middle up here. So I'm just kind of like doing the darker shade of every color. Like for example, the darker shade of green, I'll put like a little bit like under where the bun is, and then like under where the hair is stops. And then, I'm just use the lighter color of green and to blend it in. Looks a little better that way. Here's a closer look. So what do you guys think? Were you able to follow along? Don't forget to hit that like button. And also, most importantly, leave me a comment of what you want me to do next in an art tutorial. I could add a body to this if you want, and I think that would look really cool. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye. Bye.